Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to be making a homemade soap. I know that this is a plant-based channel, but I'm trying out a new recipe for making homemade soaps. So we're gonna start with a full box of Zote. I've never used this before. Full box of Arm & Hammer Superwash. We're gonna add in four pounds of baking soda. We're adding in a 1.7 ounce, 77 ounce container of OxyClean. And last but not least, we're adding in some Clean Sensations um, scent crystals or scent boosters, should I say. So according to the original recipe, you are just gonna mix all this up together, which this is quite a bit. And this measurement should yield one tablespoon of laundry detergent, I mean, one tablespoon of laundry detergent will equal a uh, load. So with this much, this should last me for quite some time. So it smells really good so far, hopefully. It's supposed to be good, a recipe for sensitive skin. I'm hoping no one gets a breakout. It cost me roughly about $25 to get all the ingredients. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix this and show you the end result. I have two containers that I'm gonna fill up with um, this powdered laundry soap. So I'm hoping you're supposed to store it in airtight containers. And um, the recipe that I originally looked at said it would last up to a year. Now, I don't know if that's true or not. You have to make sure that you mix this really well. I think the next batch that I make, I will definitely alternate the ingredients because I had to use my hands to get it mixed up completely. It smells wonderfully. It looks like a traditional powdered soap. So, at this point, it, it's, it's gonna be a go if this works out well. I was able to get two containers of laundry detergent out of this. So again, I'm not sure how long we're gonna get with it, but we're gonna definitely use this, see how it works and give you an update. All right, if you like these videos, please subscribe to my channel and have a wonderful rest of your day.